We have breaking developments in a story we first brought you at 4 o'clock. A fire at a mosque in southwest Houston is now being called suspicious. Worshippers had, in fact, just ended their afternoon prayers when the flames broke out. Channel News' Kathy Hernandez has been uh, working this story for you all day. She was first on the scene. She's live tonight with more on what investigators are saying about this. Kathy? Good evening. ATF investigators are now calling this fire suspicious after they say they found several points of origin inside the mosque. Muslims gather Friday night for prayers in a banquet hall. Just feet away, their burned mosque. Investigators inside rummaging through charred debris. A burned mosque, burned church, or a burned synagogue, or a burned temple. It's not good to see it like that. A man who prays here got an inside look at the damage with his cell phone after flames consumed the Savoy Mosque on South Wilcrest in West Belford Friday afternoon. When I left there, everything was fine, you know. We were a whole bunch of people in there. We were capacity full. Just an hour before, the mosque capacity full, filled with 200 people for prayer. It's just a place where people look for peace, people look for solutions. And people communicate with God, and and it's very very sad. The flames so intense, firefighters stayed outside for fears of the roof collapsing. People who call this mosque home want to see change. The mosque is doing a great job to educate the community, not to hurt people, and to educate people to do the good and forbid the evil. An evil that may have entered this place of worship. And investigators say they're looking at surveillance video to try to help them figure out exactly what happened inside this mosque. Putting live in Southwest Houston, Kathy Hernandez, KPRC, Channel 2 News.